Thank you, Scott. Uh, well, I just want to say a couple of things to start with. Obviously, uh, I want to send an unreserved apology. Uh, didn't mean to offend anyone. Uh, uh, I, uh, I obviously was caught off guard by, by the question. Uh, but don't get me wrong, uh, I understand that my answer was totally stupid and out of place. And, um, you know, I have no, I mean, uh, I can't say uh, sorry enough about that. Uh, also, I'd like to say sorry to, to the European Tour and uh, my European Ryder Cup teammates uh, for, you know, taking the shine away from what was a, a wonderful dinner, wonderful player, player awards dinner uh, that uh, we all thoroughly enjoyed uh, until that moment. And uh, obviously, finally, uh, most importantly, uh, I want to apologize to, to Tiger and uh, anybody that I could have offended by by the comment I made, and you know, I just say that um, you know I feel sick about it. Uh, I'm I'm truly truly sorry, and you know, I hope that uh, you know we can kind of settle things down and and hopefully move on. Okay, thank you, Sergio. We'll open the floor to some questions. We do have microphones at either side. If you have any questions, raise your hand, and we will get the mic to you. Yes, Neil. Sergio, have you uh, tried to apologise to Tiger in person, and will you be trying to do that if you haven't? Yes, I. Um, well, I don't have his phone number, but uh, I've called uh, Mark Steinberg, his his manager. Uh, he didn't pick up, but I left him a message, uh, telling him that I was very sorry, uh, that I would love to uh, to talk to them uh, as soon as possible, and and make sure that uh, that everything is is okay. Tell them how sorry I am, and uh, you know that uh, obviously it was a. Uh, a bad comment that uh, should never been said. Yes, Jim, on the left, please. Sergio, do you do you think that perhaps because of what's happened, your relationship with Tiger could in effect improve? Uh, you know, in, in the sense of of you know you're going you're going to talk with him. You hope. Do you think you, you could become closer? I I hopefully uh, I mean I th hopefully uh, say I think so. Um, it's. Uh, Obviously, like I said before, I'm uh, terribly sorry uh, about what happened, and uh, I'm sure that uh, uh, we'll be able to talk soon. To talk soon, and uh, you know, uh, I'll apologize to him face to face, and um, you know, move forward and and kind of uh, forget about the whole thing. Yes, you in, please. Sir, you, you've spoken about a silly comment and a bad comment. Do you accept it was a racist comment, or would you disagree with that? No, not at all. Uh, it wasn't. Uh, it wasn't meant that way. Um, like I said before, I was, I was caught off guard, and uh, what seemed to be a, a, a funny question, uh, and tried to give uh, a funny answer that came out totally wrong. And um, you know, I, I wanna, I wanna make sure that um, you know everybody knows that that I'm very, very sorry. You know, I, I can apologize enough, enough times. Derek, please. Uh, Sergio, did you know straight away that it was an inappropriate remark? And what's it been like this morning uh, for you? It was very hard. Um, I, uh, yeah, as soon as I left the dinner, uh, I, I started getting a sick feeling on my body. Uh, I, I didn't really sleep at all last night. Um, I felt like, uh, you know, I felt like my heart was going to come out of my body. Um, and I've been feeling you know, I had this sick feeling all day. Uh, difficult to hit a shot without thinking about it. Um, but, you know, unfortunately I said it. Uh, I wish I, uh, I didn't do it, but, you know, the only thing I can do is, is say sorry. David, in the centre, please. Uh, Sergio, you'll be aware that when uh, Fuzzy Zella made a similar remark, there was quite a backlash. Were you uh, conscious of that, and do you fear that you will get the same sort of backlash when you go to America? Uh, well, actually, David, I didn't. I didn't know about that. Um, I was noticed of it. Uh, I was made notice of it today. Um, I think. I think I was in '97, uh, so I was. I was only 17 years old, and um, I really didn't. Uh, didn't know about it, but obviously, they they pointed out to me. But like I said, uh, you know, I. Terribly sorry. Um, uh, I, I didn't mean to to make it that way, and uh, you know I hope that uh, you know we can uh, move on and, and concentrate on this wonderful tournament we have here this week. Excuse me. I, I don't know. Uh, I wish I could answer that, but 
you know, that doesn't depend on me. So the only thing I can do is say sorry. <laughs> Carl, please. Sergio, I assume you've spoken with the tour about this. I wonder, have you been made aware of any likely disciplinary measures or penalties that might be taken against you? Yes, I, um, I, I want to thank uh, the Commissioner, Tim Finchin, and the Chief Executive, um, George O'Grady, because um, I met with them as soon as, as, soon as, we, as soon as I finished my prom this morning. And um, they, were, uh, they were very good about it. Obviously, they were both in the dinner. Uh, they saw uh, exactly what happened. They were both fine with it. I told them uh, exactly how I felt. And, uh, and you know, they told me that was, uh, that was good enough for them. They, they felt very strong about it. And um, you know, I'm, I'm very thankful that you know, they were there to uh, obviously help and um, you know, uh, be behind me. I think they both accepted your apology, Sergio, didn't yeah, they? they? Yeah, they both, they both accepted my apologies, uh, uh, both of them, so they were fine with it. So there will be no further disciplinary measures, uh, you think? No, no, no they, didn't, they didn't say anything, no. Yes, Jamie, please. Time for a couple more. Sergio, I just wonder, because all the attention will be on now, you now, did you consider pulling out of this tournament at any stage today? Well, um, if uh, if you were to ask me this morning, uh, I might have. Uh, but I, th I feel like maybe my mind is is not in the greatest place at the moment. But I feel like the the tournament deserves to have me. Um, I think that the tournament has nothing to do with it. Uh, it was all on me. And um, you know, I want to go out there tomorrow and and Friday and, and give everything I have. Uh, I'll try uh, my hardest to to do well and, and make sure that the people can, can enjoy uh, watching me play. So, like I said, I, you know, I'm, I'm truly sorry, but you know, the, the tournament has, has nothing to do, to do with it. It's just a coincidence. Sergio, I think we're all done. Thank you very much for your time today. Thank you.